everyone welcome back my name is Sarah if you're new here thanks for coming along so question for you guys what do you do with a succulent pumpkin you plant it up of course so let's go do that okay well we got two pots over here I've got two pumpkins so let's get this going okay so we're gonna start with the little one first this is one of my favorite pots it's got the little stairs that go all the way down super cute anyway and we're gonna put in this little pumpkin arrangement who actually the Fred Ives is blooming but you know these are really pretty so we're just gonna let him stay and all you're gonna do is so basically these were cut off glued on so six months ago about anyway all you're gonna do is since this is glued on top of moss and we're just gonna actually leave the moss there so you're just gonna gently try to take this whole arrangement off without disturbing it too much it might not be perfect but close enough okay well that's pretty good <laughs> yes so there you go and this all I'm going to do is put this right on top of there and voila that's it I'm gonna go ahead and this little one that still decided to stay on I'll just pull him off stick him on in right about there have another little desiccated golem which we will appreciate some water and we'll stick him in here too so one down one more to go that turned out quite easy i just i really want to fill all the soil all the way to the top because you're not going to be planting anything in here you're literally just laying it on top so same thing with this one you know what he's pretty light <laughs> whoops uh oh that's okay um he fits in there nicely so you're just going to gently try and i'm just kind of moving my fingers and getting underneath this in the hopes of just basically sliding this whole thing off the pumpkin which looks like it's going to go just kind of go all the way around it just to be safe there you go now we're going to put this down ah there you go so that pumpkin is done. Put him over here. So he's a little bit smaller than this pot. So I'm actually gonna get a little bit more soil. I'm gonna stick him up a little bit higher. And I'm probably, if I had plants, I would put some in here. I don't have any. So I'm gonna do some top dressing with some rocks. So I'm gonna add some more soil, put in some rocks around this and uh, do that so let me go grab a little bit more soil and some rocks okay so we're all done like I said I put it this way because I have this spilling out and it really wouldn't fit otherwise I would have had to force it and break this and I don't really want to do that so the whole idea is to basically reuse these plants and propagate them so I'm gonna leave them as is I'm gonna water both of these pots and get them nice and wet and let them start putting in better roots and really come back to life so let's go do that real quick yeah, some of these little Fred Ives had some little either mealybug or mildew. I'm not sure which, but whatever it is, I'm giving them a good little blast to uh, make it all go away. They've been sitting on the front patio, not getting a whole lot of sun. So I think they just need a little bit TLC. I also haven't had any soil for a while, so I'm sure they will appreciate this. And probably once things bounce back, I'll probably go ahead and transplant a lot of this into a different arrangement. Okay, well, there we go. We've got the pumpkins all planted up. Probably put the actual pumpkins in the compost bin over there. And we are all done for the day. What do you have to say for yourself, Lucy? Anything exciting? Nope. Okay. Well, that's it for the day. Thanks for coming along, and we'll catch you guys again on the next video. Okay, thanks. Bye-bye.